It was this a is hard pass, Cal. Oh, yeah. This is hard pass. That's I'm going to give it up. All right, let's get up and do it. All right, so oh, yeah. first and foremost, shout out to Robert the Weep, Robert the Reaper Whitaker. Whitaker, Robert Whitaker. Man went out there and put on a spectacular it's, performance. Let me see if I can pull up the knockout for you real quick. No quick. relation to Forrest. No. But what if they are first cousins? They wouldn't be first cousins. Why you say that? They skin color. Well, I said what if. That would be a crazy coincidence. It would be. Crazy coincidence. You you know uh, MMA Guru? Yeah. I was, to, I was watching a video um, that uh, one of his clip channels posted. Mm-hmm. And uh, he was uh, saying a bunch of uh, racist stuff. They was talking about bears. And they was talking about, would you rather uh, get into a fight with a black bear or a brown bear? Mm-hmm. And, you know. A black bear is obviously a black person. And yeah. A brown bear is like the brown skinned people of Mexican. Or yeah. And that uh, they went on this whole uh, tangent calling, uh, saying certain things about black bears, saying black. I, I, I just I just can't find it easy to like black bears because they always, you know, feel like they're entitled to something. Dang. <laughs> hey, that's funny. But yeah, he, he was like joking. But uh, hmm. one of the that's one of the things that I do like about him, though, because it's like so. One of my uh, favorite comedians is Andrew Schultz. So mm-hmm. because yeah. of that, I when Andrew so- Schultz say a racist joke, I don't get mad about it. Or I don't think other people should get mad about it. Yeah. And it's, anybody can get it. It's not uh, one particular branch of people. And uh, same thing with Family Guy. Mm-hmm. They do uh, racist jokes all the they time. But it's, it. it's everybody. Yeah. And it's like, uh-huh. that's, that's Guru. Yeah. And, and Shout out to Guru. That's one of the reasons that. I I don't get mad at his stuff because it, it ain't just in a particular direct. I ain't mean to type in him. Gotcha. It, it, it ain't in a particular direction, but everybody can get in and everybody will get it. Uh, but his fan base will jump in too, and then those are the ones that I don't be. I ain't yeah, sure about. Yeah, yeah, I, I know how that go. Because some some of them be saying it out of you know. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to, to them though. Yeah. I tell you what. Yeah, a lot of them subscribed to the channel after he had uh, shot me out on the stream. <sighs> Say, hey, guys, it's these two uh, black guys. Oh, got, it got, was, got it was just me that he was talking about because that's how I did the reaction with his commentary. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, when yeah. people came. Oh, okay. No homo. Yeah, Paul. Can I say that? Well, it's in there now. Mm. Who cares, man? I know who cares. That's true. Good point. <laughs> All right, here you go. Let's do it. God, dog. Rock. That man did the money. One, two. Head kick. That's mm. my favorite combination by him. He missed it, though, because Buddy uh, was off balance. But if Buddy didn't lose his footing, he would have been done on that one, two head kick. I think but he that, still uh, could have fight. It, no. I wouldn't that stop uppercut, it. That uppercut laid him out cold, I wouldn't Chuck. stop it. I wouldn't have stopped it right there. Here you go. All right. It's in slow motion. Boom. Right there, I wouldn't have stopped it. He ain't stopped it yet. He, I still wouldn't have stopped it. I would have let look at it go that. for a Look at how he seconds. fall. I mean, I, yeah, he fell. But but, he, but it was hard, though. It wasn't like a simple fall. He'd go, boom. <sighs> look at his eyes. Look at his eyes. I'm going to put in full screen for you so you can really see. Hey, <laughs> you stupid. I wouldn't have stopped it that soon. Mm. Look at his eyes. I see his eyes. He don't even know where he at no more. How I get here? <laughs> I wouldn't have stopped it that fast. He was done, Chuck. He Show got rocked on. three times. I wouldn't have stopped it. Show it one more time. Matter of fact, let's start from here. <sighs> Boom. Rocked. Wobbling all over the place. Chicken dance. Hmm. One, two, head kick. He falls. Boom. Third time he fell. I wouldn't have stopped it that fast. All right. You got it. You That's got just it. me. Anyway. Shout out to Robert Whitaker. I would want to make sure he he ain't coming back. So you want him to be, matter of fact, you want him to be like this. After Johnny Walker do the flying knee, you'll see. All right, here it come. Hey. <laughs> you want it to be like yeah. that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's sad, man. Yeah. 
That because that way you know it's over. You know you know he ain't coming back. But you you giving them extra uh, damage, man. I felt like the last guy. He could have make it. He could have lasted at least five more seconds. That's all I'm. Do saying. you think anything different would have happened? We will never know. Yeah. We will never know. You should be ashamed of yourself. Cause see, Papa always get 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 beat up. And then he drank his spinach. Maybe one of them uppercuts would have been his spinach. You got to think outside the box, Trav. Stop the cap, Joe. L for the ref. All right, let's get into UFC 303, man. Yes, yeah, so, sir. You want to start at the top or the bottom? Uh, Let's start at the top. All right, Alex Pereira versus Yuri Pahaska 2. Yep. Hot 2. Spit on that thing. You get me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, who you got? I hope Alex uh, beat Buddy. I'm leaning towards Alex. I think Alex is going to win. Um, I hope Alex win every fight so Jamal can get his uh, rematch and knock him out in the first round. So gotcha. I, I'm going for Alex. Makes sense. Makes Stone sense. Stone face. <sighs> well, right. That's the wrong foot. For me, <laughs> for me, that uh, first fight, there's a lot for Yuri to learn from. But Yuri strikes me as the kind of guy. That's saying F all that. He going to go out there and fight however he want to fight. That's what Jamal said. And if he do that, Alex going to knock him out. Knock him out. But if he learned anything from that first fight, he could win. And he could win easily and convincingly. But I don't think he that guy, man. Yeah, I don't think so either. I got Alex. It really come down to the the, the people he got around him. If he got the people that around him to say, hey, whenever you grapple with him, he was lost. Whenever you... uh, it was something else he did really well. He didn't stay in the fire. Like, he continued to um, just... Because Yuri is one of the most awkward fighters ever. It's like... He he fight like a drunken samurai. Mm. But then he like had got off, off that and then it. started rushing in. And then that's when Alex caught him. Mm-hmm. But yeah, so... <sighs> off a automatic pick, I got to go Alex, man. Yo, oh, smart just, man. Smart man. I just got to. Smart man. Brian Ortega versus Diego Lopez. I'm going Diego Lopez. Number 14 fighting number three. Mm, God, dog. Well, let me say this. Talk about it. I don't care about neither one of these guys. Dang. All right. Well, next fight. Yeah, so. Anthony Smith versus Roman Delitze. I think Roman going to win, but I, I like Anthony Smith. So I'm pulling for Anthony Smith. Yeah. I think Anthony Smith going to win. I think uh, Roman Delitze, he... He not as good as uh, everybody think he is. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Myra Bueno Silva, a.k.a. the Confused Chick, versus Macy Chasson. (laughs) You remember? Yeah, I do. (laughs) She's looking like, why am I standing right here? (laughs) Uh, I think Myra Bueno Silva's going to win, though. Word. It's going to be a submission. You think so? Yeah. I'm pulling for Macy. Why? Because she like Bart Simpson? Because she looked like a dude. That's true. That is how you're usually supposed to pick women's fights, by Yeah, the way. she looked like a Whoever dude. looks more like a dude, you pick that person. I think she's staying up when she pee. I can see that. I can see that. For real. And I think it stinks, too. Dang! But anyway. Neither here nor there. Yes, sir. Ian Machado Gary versus Michael Venom Page, MVP. I think Ian going to take it, but, but I'm never going to choose... A white man over a black man. So I got Michael He's Page. He's from London, you know. He's still black, Trey. Okay. I was just saying. I hope Michael Page knock his white ass out. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just playing, shit. I ain't that Holy kind of person. Shit. But yeah, I do I, think uh, Ian going to win. I kind of want Ian to win. Yeah. But no matter who win, I'm still happy. But I kind of think Ian going to uh, beat him. I, I kind of want Ian to beat him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But hey, I can't. I can't. Th- this fight is, is truly going to be... Uh, a difference maker, whoever wins. Like, whoever wins is likely going to contend for the title soon. I think Ian going to beat him. And I don't think it's going to be that good. Man, when I think about that Kevin Holland fight, Kevin Holland got quite a chin on him, and he was able to take some shots that I don't think most people could take. I seen Ian Gary get knocked down once. I think Michael Venom Page can catch him. I'm going Michael Venom Page. You going Michael Venom Page? I'm going Michael Venom Page. We going to see. We going to see. I want Michael to win. Well, I don't know. I'm going in, but 
I would never dare say you that. You wouldn't mind either one of them. Women. Yeah, it don't matter in that one right there. All right, the prelims uh, feature fight, Joe Pfeiffer versus Mark Andre Barry, however you say his last name. I'm going Joe Pfeiffer. Joe Pfeiffer going to beat him, and it's going to be easy. I got Joe Pfeiffer, too. Shout out mm-hmm. to him. Cub Swanson versus Andre Feely. Mm. I actually don't know this fight. I uh, think I think I'm going to go Andre Feely. I think uh, he's going to be longer. He's going to touch him up with leg kicks. And after he tightened his leg up enough, he's going to uh, catch him with the hands a little bit. It's probably going to be a decision, though. But go ahead. Both of them look like they uh, should be in prison. Dang! But um, That's true, though. I think Cub looks like he should be in prison a little more. Yeah. Cub, oh, you know. He I think he's 39. Like, he looked like he should have done 39 years in prison. Dang! But, uh, yeah. Since that's birth, like, bro? Dang. <laughs> he's <laughs> born up in there. <laughs> All right, let's move, uh, on. Let's move Charles on. Jordan versus Jean Silva. I'm going Charles Jordan. Yeah, I, never, I don't know though. I, I never seen either one of these fight, but I, uh, I've seen Charles Jordan fight a few times, but I never. I I might have seen Jean Silva fight, but I just don't remember. Yeah, I would probably say Charles because his first name, but I never seen either one of these guys fight. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Never seen one of these guys fight. Peyton Talbert uh, versus Yanez. How you say that? Gamori. You might be right. All right. Well, yeah, well, I don't bet. know. Uh, but I'm going Peyton. Easy. Uh, I mean, the odds say it. <laughs> this is yeah. a layup right here for Peyton. So. There you go. I'm going to probably go Peyton because of his hair. Yeah. He got a strong chin. Who his hair remind you of? If it uh, had colors in it. What? What? It, it really remind me of uh, what that quarterback name for the Kansas City Chiefs, man. Pat Mahomes. Oh, okay, okay. And uh, what his name is, the guy from High School Musical, the black guy? I don't know. I want to say he Corridor zero? and Blue, but that's some food. So He was Zero and Holes? No. Oh, okay. Different guy. Yeah. Shout out to uh, Zero, though. <laughs> Shout out to Shia LaBeouf, too. All right. Uh, Michelle Watterson versus Jillian Robertson. Listen, man. Who was Michelle Watterson last fight, bro? Her last fight, she Marina loved. Rodriguez, and Marina Rodriguez beat her so bad that she had started crying. Mm. Serious? Yeah. Let me see Dang, that's fight. crazy. That's crazy. Why the fuck does this happen? That's work? crazy. <laughs> you all right, man? Yeah, real quick, man. Go ahead. So I'm on our Facebook. And you know how Facebook be sharing the uh, X links and it be the nasty stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah so I daggone clicked on one. And it was a girl giving a guy that hawk too. <laughs> <laughs> and the video was like six seconds. And it was over. And I was like, the girl pretty attractive. So I checked the, the comments for the girl name to see where I could find some more content. And uh, one of the content... A guy, cause the video was six seconds. The yeah. one, the guy said it was too short. It a guy comment under that. The dude <laughs> of the video. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing though. Like that, that's the wrong thing to say. But then, <laughs> then the dude comment, he was like, "No, bro, bro, I was talking about the video." <laughs> God Dang. dog. Well, yeah, I was thinking the same thing, but I he yeah. just comment. He set himself up. Well, Chuck, I can't find it. Anyway. Got on. Yeah. So right back, Michelle Watterson, last fight. She fought Marina Rodriguez. Marina Rodriguez beat that so bad. Uh, she was bloody. She was crying. Dang. And I was thinking right then she should retire. Dang. She didn't want to retire off that though, and I don't blame her. She want to go out worse, hey boy. Well, this ain't the person that's gonna make it be worse. Jillian Robinson just gonna grapple. She might sub her, so uh, I'm gonna have to go Jillian Robinson by. You know what, Michelle Watterson takedown defense is pretty good. It's gonna be decision man. She looked like the uh, girl I, I, I drive trucks with, Yolanda. You know, I want to say it so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna do it though. Yeah, <laughs> she, 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 she do. Oh, that's Look how she like, looked, though? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I mean, uh, Yolanda's brown skin, but yeah, that, yeah, that, I see what you mean. the neck up, they, yeah. they favor each other very well. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Yep, that's Michelle Watterson. 
folks. Yes, that's the Karate Hottie. That's a nickname, by the way. That's a nickname. Mm-hmm. The, oh, it's right there. That Karate wasn't working last fight. <laughs> no, it wasn't. <laughs> Not when she had somebody of more, some more karate than him. Uh, oh, shoot. Andre Olowski on here? Dang, versus Martin Boudet. I got who? Oh, Both of them is not the... I'm going to go Martin Boudet. I'm gonna just, Andre. just because Andre Olowski should just retire, bro. God dang, man. <sighs> that fight. Open in the card, they got Ricky Simone versus some Oliveira dude. <laughs> what do you think, Vinicius? All right. Either way, I'm going Ricky Simone. I go Vinicius. Bet. Matter of fact, I ain't even bleed him yet. Can I bleed him? Mm. Yet? No, for real. Yeah. Uh, UFC 303, though. I'm looking forward to it. The uh, whole card got as far as name value go. I give it an 8.5. Man, I feel bad. I might even give it a nine. Feel bad. What do you feel bad about? I'm gonna be in Atlanta. At any rate, drop down in the comments. Let us know who y'all got for UFC 303. Yes, and uh, what's the fight that you're most looking forward to in UFC 303? Yes, all. That's all. Let's go!